record holders. Uh, we referenced Katinka Hosu, who we saw last night win the 400 IM. And she has just had an outstanding Arena Pro Swim Series. She will be the lane five swimmer, number one qualifier. As you see her prior achievements in this 200 meter butterfly. And it is special guest weekend at Santa Clara Rally. Mm. And I have been joined by U.S. Olympian Dana Vollmer with husband Andrew and Arlen. It is a pleasure to be How here. How about this? This is a whole new Dana Vollmer we're seeing, <laughs> holding Arlen in your lap. Yeah, he is three and a half months now. Man, that is amazing. Yeah. Olympic gold medalist, world record holder still in the Hunter Butterfly. Yeah, it's, it's been amazing to watch and uh, you know, I'm glad it still stands, and it's, uh, it was it was fun to see people getting closer, and uh, uh, I look forward to to watching it. Let's see the nine women in this final again. Nine lanes in the Santa Clara pool. Virginia Bardak from Argentina is in lane one. She was uh, in the finals of the 400 IM last night. Diana Luna Sanchez of Mexico. Kelsey Lene from Longhorn Aquatics in Texas. She's in lane three. Andriana Pinto from Venezuela. She's a two-time Olympian for Venezuela. Osu went 209.7. That was her prelim swim this morning. Second fastest qualifier, Lauren Case, 17-year-old from the Chattahoochee Gold Swim Club in Georgia. From UCLA, Noel Tarazona. She will swim in lane seven. 17-year-old Emily Overholt. We saw her in a couple of finals last night. She'll be in lane eight and a local swimmer. Now at Stanford, Ali Howe, 19 year old, will swim in lane nine. Camille Adams and Katie McLaughlin are the two who will swim this in Kazan for the United States. Neither is here in Santa Clara. All right, so Dana, when you watch swimming, do you want to get back in? I do, I miss it. I mean, I miss the thrill and I never thought that I would miss the nerves. You know, it's, I miss the nerves. I used to, I always got nervous beforehand, and that was something that I thought I wouldn't miss, and, and I want to be back in and, and feel that thrill, and it's, mm -hmm. it is definitely something that I didn't think I would miss, but you do. Now, don't you think the follow-up question is <laughs> maybe something, there's some rumors floating around that maybe you are in the water swimming and just exploring the option about next summer? Is that fair to say? I mean, I, I hated when I saw the rumors that I actually retired. I never did retire. I always wanted to leave it open for myself, and uh, I want to get back into shape. And, you know, it's one of those things that if I can get back in shape, maybe I'll see what I can go in the pool. But lifestyle-wise, I want to be extremely active with my son and in life in general. And so, yeah, I'm just loving it so far. I'm sitting here listening to you, Dan. The first thing I'm thinking, what a great description of postpartum that is. You want to get out? Seriously, you want to get back in the water, be in shape, be healthy as you've always been. Yeah, yeah, back. I know how to get into shape and eat healthy and set that lifestyle for my family. And yeah, so if that includes being in the pool, uh, it has so far, and it's, it's been uh, really fun getting back in the water. And so Hosu, a pretty good, uh, you've been able to watch from a distance, Katinka Hosu is having some winter, spring into summer. I think every time that girl hits the water, uh, she's, she's been swimming fantastic and going great times this season so yeah. far. And a great butterfly. Is there something that you see that you recognize as, a, as something outstanding in that fly stroke? I think that she knows, she knows, especially having to do the 400 IM and, and how to have a fly that's from rhythm and, and not a muscular fly. Now she was the clear favorite in this race, and you can see more than a body length ahead. It would be a nice effort if uh, Lauren Case could hold on here. Well, Emily Overhold in lane eight's coming up to push for second. Three and a half second lead off the prelim. She's not going to win by three and a half seconds here, but clearly start to finish she had it. But boy, I tell you, close the gap a little bit here at the end. And Hosu does come in at 209.77, just under 210. Emily Overholt does get second, and Lauren Case third. So a couple of 17-year-olds that swim well behind the veteran Hosu, who wins her second event in Santa Clara. Good swim by Lauren Case. That's the best time by over a half a second. There's the last turn right here. And as you can see, Hosu completely 